security is not what it used to be that you know developers don't want to talk to security teams because they'll slip now i feel and i may be wrong i like to say that i see security as an enabler when you put those guardrails around you know the gates around that so de developer know that this is their safe place they can they can play they can innovate without worrying about breaking things what is your approach so we are perfectly aligned in that approach in fact at lineage uh, we have what's called an open source manager. The intent of the open source manager is to allow developers the freedom to find and use the libraries and tools that they need to do, but applying policies that are fine-grained policies based on risk. So it's not simply a, a deny list or an allow list. Those we know are just, you know, they're too blunt, right, of an instrument to use. And so what we uh, derive is a risk-based set of policy. So as long as what you're bringing in uh, as a third-party component, open source component, meets those thresholds, you can use it. Now let's say something doesn't meet, meet those thresholds, then we we'll enable further analysis so you can approve and accept those risks and then bring those things in. But this is a way to help drive greater efficiency and allow greater freedom, but still adding the protections uh, that your organization will need uh, in terms of what you're using as third-party components at open source. And then the other part to it is, let's say there are components that are critical, but also have critical risks in it. We've developed what we call Lineage AI that understands the full stack software bill of materials and will guide the developer through fixing these in what we call smart plan ways. So most tools today will give you, okay, your, this component has a vulnerability at version one, patch it to the latest vulnerability, uh, patch it to the latest version, version 10. Well, oftentimes you put in version 10 and it'll break your software or it'll introduce two new vulnerabilities. So what we do is a comprehensive analysis of all the components, give you the upgrade path that won't break your software but reduce the most risk and guide you through the actual remediation itself. We're finding many companies that have implemented our tool are achieving about a 40% efficiency gain because they're breaking the cycle of patching, retesting, patching, retesting.